Her Majesty wants to meet. Will she come? Sure. <laughs> sure. Then you shall. Yeah. I wonder if you rip and get the cradle as your. I am doing it. Sure. Follow me then. Can we start with the negotiations? You are not worthy of our attention. We came to talk to our brother, Regulus. We know you are invested in this war, yet we have decided to overlook this blatant sabotage of our rule. If you join our army, we will absolve you of your crimes. Curious. Why would you do that, my little sister? Because only together might we still save what is left of the Naboru Empire. Ah, so you do realize you need me. Good. You know I will have a few conditions. We are frightfully aware of that. Yes, we need you. We also need to get to the Citadel and persuade the Ratkins to start peace negotiations. Peace with the Ratkins? That's unexpected. Are you feeling well, my dear? And more importantly, can we postpone that? We admire your prudence. We need to be pragmatic, though. We have lost the city. Our armies are decimated. How many men do you have? Twenty? Thirty? More than you think, sister. Still, it won't be sufficient. Our only option is to negotiate. Wait. Be patient. They will realize they need us. They will want our technology. They will need our wisdom. Eventually, we shall be able to find a mutually beneficial agreement. It might take some time, but the Naboru will prevail. I would rather not wait. Ascended one, now! Kill her now! You traitor! I am on the side of the Firkins, not yours, and so I'm not betraying you, my lady. I'm simply choosing a future negotiation partner with a better attitude. And easier access to the Cradle, so... Nothing personal. Now die. I am impressed. Those tales fail to do you justice. You just slit her like an overly ripe fruit. I hate too ripe fruit. I have no doubts now. You. You were her new confidant? What happened to Gracchus? Also killed by Silver. That's rather unfortunate. You just can't help yourself, right? Always undermining order and justice. I just gave you a new and better king. Since you are so keen on the Naboru, one would assume you can appreciate the beautiful complexity of their political system. Shut up! Silence. Both of you. I am sorry for the following theatricals, yet they are necessary. Hasten to your furry beasts now for our common safety. We will be in our royal citadel if you need us. Highest defenders of Naboru, you have seen this vicious traitor murder our queen. I know you thirst for revenge now. Yet he is an emissary of the Ratkin leader, so he will have to face justice later. I need some volunteers to secure our citadel, so we can prepare for my resuming of the rule of our nation. You, Queen's Champion, bring the rest of our army to the coast. It is much needed there. Our citizens need your protection. Yes, Your Majesty. 